So you're moving to Northern Virginia and specifically Loudoun County. Well, guess what? You literally just stumbled on the best video possible because in this week's video, I'll share with you the good, the bad, the ugly, the real pros and cons of living right here in Loudoun County. And we're getting started right now. Hey everybody, it is David, your favorite realtor. As always, you know it's another beautiful day right here in Northern Virginia. And if it's your first time here on my channel, please do me a favor, hit that subscribe button because every week I release videos was like the live, work, play, pros and cons, top neighborhoods, cost of living, basically everything that you need to know about living right here in Northern Virginia. <laughs> So I've personally lived in Loudoun County now for 10 years. I can't believe it's been 10 years now. Time definitely flies. And then the previous 12 years, I lived in Fairfax County. And I always say, as long as I live in Northern Virginia, I 100% will always live in Loudoun County. But just like anything else in life, there's gonna be some pros and there's definitely gonna be some cons to living in Loudoun County. So before I jump into those, I'll share with you a quick overview of Loudoun County. So Loudoun County is gonna be one of the four major counties right here in Northern Virginia. And it's gonna be about 26 to 60 miles away from Washington, D.C. And some of the main towns in Loudoun County is gonna be Ashburn, Bramilton, Leesburg, Aldi, just to name a few. So one thing you should definitely know about Loudoun County, half of it, which is gonna be Western Loudoun, is gonna be the rural side. A lot of farmland, it may take you 10, 15 minutes to get to the closest grocery store. And then the other half is gonna be the suburban side. So you're gonna have a lot of master plan communities, restaurants, town centers, and so much more. So let's get it started right now with the first pro that you must know about living in Loudoun County, and that's gonna be newer homes and infrastructure. So everything is gonna be much newer in Loudoun County, especially compared to like Fairfax and Arlington County. So since the infrastructure is so much newer in Loudoun County, that's gonna give you newer neighborhoods, newer buildings, newer roads, newer shopping plazas and town centers, newer schools, we have the brand new Metro Station and so much more. In fact, if we took a time machine all the way back to 1995, which is not that long ago, by the way, Loudoun County will look so much different. It was very undeveloped back then. And my dad, he lived in Fairfax County in the 90s and the early 2000s. And he told me he literally never went to Loudoun County because there was no reason to go there because there was nothing to do. But that has completely changed, especially in the past five to 10 years. So we've talked about having a newer infrastructure here in Loudoun County, but that leads to much newer homes. And that's one of people's favorite parts about living in Loudoun County. In fact, 50% of all the homes built in Loudoun County were built after the year 2000. Now, if we compare that to Fairfax County, only 12.5% of all homes in Fairfax County were built after the year 2000. That is a huge difference. And obviously, there's so many pros to having a much newer home. You have the latest design trends, less wear and tear. They tend to be bigger compared to homes that were built maybe in the 70s or 80s. So hands down, this is probably people's most favorite part about living in Loudoun County, just how new everything is compared to other parts of Northern Virginia. Now, the next pro is Loudoun County is a fantastic place to raise a family. So if you've been following my channel for the past three years, you'll know that I actually don't have any kids. However, special announcement, that is literally gonna change in April of this year, expecting my firstborn, and I'm gonna put my money where my mouth is. There's nowhere else I'd rather raise my family than right here in Loudoun County. So why is Loudoun County a great place to raise a family? Well, one is highly rated schools. And according to niche.com, Loudoun County School District ranks as the fifth best school district in the whole state of Virginia. Another reason is, the master plan communities here in Loudoun County, they were literally built for families, beautiful homes, ton of amenities. A lot of these master plan communities here in Loudoun County will have the schools right in the neighborhood. And not to mention when I'm driving around these neighborhoods, I always see so many kids playing in the neighborhoods, whether they're playing basketball, softball, baseball, playing tag, riding bikes. It just looks like a fantastic place to raise a family, but don't take my word for it. 
All my clients, all my friends, all my family who live here in Loudoun County, they all say the same thing. Loudoun County is a fantastic place to raise a family. Now, as much as I love making YouTube videos about living right here in Northern Virginia, what I love even more is helping folks just like you relocate to Northern Virginia. So if you're even thinking about moving to the area, reach out to me, give me a call, shoot me a text, send me email. You can even schedule a live Zoom call with me one-on-one. -on -one. But whatever you gotta do to get a hold of me, just know I got your back when you're moving to Northern Virginia. Now, the next pro is safety. Now, I'm not looking up any stats here. This is just from my personal experience. You know, do your own research. Don't just listen to me. But I've lived in Loudoun County, like I said, for a little bit over 10 years now. And in 10 years, I've only felt unsafe maybe twice, maybe three times most. And all two or three of those times are in the same area. There's re really only one area in Loudoun County that's a little rough around the edges. I'm not going to name that area in this video. If you want to know, reach out to me but I really never feel unsafe here. And I've definitely been to other parts of Northern Virginia and I've been like, I'm in the wrong part of town. I need to get out of here right now. So I think that's a great part about living in Loudoun County is really how safe it is, at least from my personal experience. If my wife wants to go walk around the neighborhood by herself, I have zero worries at all. Now, I'm not saying there's zero crime in Loudoun County. Obviously that is impossible. You know, like I said, do your own research. But from my personal experience, I love the safety of living right here in Loudoun County. The next pro is entertainment. So much entertainment to do in Loudoun County. I literally could do a whole video on this topic and I probably will in the future, but I'll keep it short and sweet for this video. First, you have One Loudoun. One Loudoun is basically the downtown of Loudoun County. You have the movie theater right there, ton of great restaurants. One of my favorites is Uncle Julio, some of the best fajitas in Loudoun County. Also, One Loudoun is a great place to meet your coworkers for happy hour. It's a great place to walk around with the kiddos. And it's a fantastic place for a date night. The wife and I go to One Loudon probably once every two to three weeks for a date night. Obviously it helps that I live in One Loudon so we can just walk there. Then you have downtown historic Leesburg and that's gonna be a charming downtown. Great place to walk around, feel the history of Leesburg. They also have some really great local mom and pop restaurants and bars. Highly recommend checking it out. Then Loudon County operates over 40 parks and recreations. And these parks offer amenities like playgrounds, sports fields, hiking, pools, and even some of these pools have massive water slides and so much more. And then you have the wineries of Loudoun County. Actually, Loudoun County is no, known as DC's wine country. And you can find over 40 wineries in Loudoun County. And I've talked about it in past videos. It is so much fun to go on like a Saturday afternoon when it's like springtime. Go to the winery with your friends, your family, and just enjoy the local wine. It's just a great time overall. Now, the next pro is traffic. And you're probably thinking, David, how is traffic a pro? I've heard the traffic in Northern Virginia is horrible. That is true for most of it. Now, the traffic when you're actually in Loudoun County is not that bad at all. Now, I'm not saying there's zero traffic, obviously it's gonna happen, but if you compare the traffic of Loudoun County to like Fairfax and Arlington County, it does not compare. I mean, I can literally get from one part of Loudoun County to the other part of Loudoun County with very little traffic overall. Now, chances are if you live in Loudoun County, you probably are gonna have to go to Fairfax and Arlington County, maybe for work. So you will have traffic in those parts, but a big pro of Loudoun County is a lot less traffic compared to other parts of Northern Virginia. Now, off to the cons of living in Loudoun County. And the first con you're definitely gonna wanna know about is airplane noise. So Dulles Airport is gonna be located in Loudoun County. So chances are you're gonna hear airplane noise depending on where you live. Some places are louder than others. But where I live in Ashford, I definitely hear planes. Now, I will say this, I hear it a lot more if I'm walking outside, you know, if I'm walking with the wife, uh, I'll hear an airplane go by. Sometimes they're louder than other times, but they're definitely there. Now, the flip side is when I'm inside of my house and the windows are closed, I'm watching TV, I don't hear any planes. Or if I'm even trying to sleep at nighttime, I'm not, it's not like, it's a loud engine right outside my window and I can't sleep. It is not that serious. But I will say this, if you're walking outside in most parts of Loudoun County, you will hear your airplane noise. Now on to the next con, and that's gonna be the cost of living. And this is hands down the biggest con of living in Loudoun County. So if you don't know, Loudoun County is one of the wealthiest counties in the country. So obviously the cost of living is gonna reflect that. And the majority of that high cost of living is gonna come with housing. So before I dive into the cost of living, I did a really great video about four months ago explaining my personal cost of living right here in Loudoun County. Definitely check it out so you can get a real idea of what the cost of living is. So let's talk about cost of housing. 
So the average sales price of a house here in Loudoun County is $741,000, and that is way above the national average. And if you just want to look at single family homes, the average sales price of a single family home here in Loudoun County comes out to $946,000. That is extremely high. And then if we look at the rental side, you really don't get much relief there as well. The average three plus bedroom home to rent in Loudoun County comes out to $3,046 per month. In fact, I personally have an investment property here in Ashburn, just a little two bedroom, thousand square foot condo, and that rents for $2,200 per month. Literally, there's other parts of the country where you can get a full 4,000 square foot single family home for that price. So yes, the cost of housing is a lot more here compared to other parts of the country, but some things are actually less expensive here compared to other parts of the country. For example, which I did not know until very recently, car insurance here in Virginia it's actually a little bit less compared to like Washington, D.C. and Maryland. I had no idea until my go-to insurance guy told me that. And then another thing, your homeowner's insurance could be a lot less here in Virginia. Let's say you're coming from Florida. The homeowner's insurance in Florida is actually a lot more compared to here in Virginia because they have a lot more natural disasters like hurricanes and things like that, which we really don't get here. So that's really good. Little savings right there. Also, our property taxes are not that crazy high. I've helped clients relocate from like Texas or New Jersey. And they tell me what they pay in property taxes and i've seen it as high as three times more compared to what they would be paying right here in Loudoun county so those items may not be enough to really offset the high cost of housing but you know what every penny helps so yes you do have high cost of living here in Loudoun county but you get what you pay for northern virginia overall is one of the most affluent and wealthy areas in the country great schools beautiful infrastructure, especially newer homes here in Loudoun County. So yes, it is expensive to live in Loudoun County, but in my opinion, 100% worth it. Now the next con is Loudoun County is far away from Arlington and Washington, DC. So why is this a con? So Loudoun County is a great place to live. However, the majority of the jobs are gonna be in Fairfax County, Arlington County, or even as far as Washington, DC. So chances are you may have to make that commute to Arlington or DC. So depending on where you live in Loudoun County, that can be anywhere from like 25 to 60 miles away. In fact, my wife, we live here in Ashburn, but she works in Washington, D.C. and it's far away. It takes her a solid hour to get there, sometimes even an hour and a half depending on traffic. Now there are some ways to make your commute into D.C. or Arlington a lot quicker. You can pay for the toll road, that'll get you a lot faster, but obviously you gotta pay the money. And then second, Loudoun County finally opened its first metro station stop literally like two months ago. So now you have the option of taking the Metro from the Ashburn station all the way into as far as Washington, DC. Now you, it may not save you on time, but at least you don't have the stress of sitting in traffic. You can just sit on the train, you can relax, or you can work on some work emails, kind of get ahead of the day, things like that. But yes, if you can be working in Washington, DC or Arlington, and you wanna live in Loudoun County, really take into consideration how far away they are and your commute times. Because if you don't like long commutes or being stuck in traffic then maybe Loudoun County may not be for you you may want to look more towards like Fairfax County or even Arlington County now the next con is and this is probably my least favorite thing about living in Loudoun County and probably going to be your least favorite thing about living in Loudoun County and that is the personal property tax aka the car tax so the personal property tax is a tax that you pay to the county once a year and that's going to be for like motorcycles boats airplanes mobile homes things like that now, most people don't have boats or planes, but everybody has a car, so that's why I just call it a car tax. So the way the personal property tax works is you pay $4.20 for every $100 of assessed value. So around every September or October timeframe, I get this in the mail and I open it. It's a nice, nice big fat bill. And this past September, it said $1,800. I'm like, I don't wanna pay $1,800. That is the worst. Much rather go on vacation with that money or invest that money. But unfortunately, you have to pay it. So just keep that in mind. Once a year, you're gonna have to pay that bill. But at least every year, in theory, your car goes down in value. So that bill does get lower and lower until you decide to buy that $250,000 sports car. Then next thing you know, you're paying $8,000 a year in personal property tax. But it's funny, when people reach out to me saying they're moving to Northern Virginia, I would say eight out of 10 people always bring up the car tax. They wanna know more information about it. And it is what it is. It's a necessary evil of living here in Lowney County, but you know what? All the pros outweigh this kind of really big con of living in Loudoun County. So again, if you've been thinking about moving to Loudoun County or anywhere else in Northern Virginia, reach out to me. I got your back. And if you want to learn more about living in Loudoun County or the rest of Northern Virginia, check out these videos right here. They're going to be great videos to continue your research. And I'll see you on the next video.